channel okay so today's video is part two of the back to school series which is basically my clothing haul along with my shoes but i'm so excited so happy because originally the shoes that i wanted to wear on the first day of school were supposed to come after and so i was going to be stuck with wearing shoes that i didn't want to wear and my first day of school outfit i still can't wear it because the shirt is taking forever to come it's from alfred eden and it still hasn't even been near my state it's in indianapolis indianapolis i don't know how to pronounce that word and we have a box this is the first time that machine clothes have ever came in a box whenever i order a lot of stuff like they always try to fit it into a big bag like no just give me a box so this is my back to school clothing haul part one of the hauls because I also have my supplies, but there's also just a few other stuff that isn't clothes that I'm going to include in this, but it's not school supplies. It's just like stuff that can accessorize me, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. First thing that I want to do, I don't know if I should say the best for last, but I'm like too excited and I kind of want to get the talking portion like out of the way. Let's get it. But I got my first pair of Jordan 4s. I also got another pair, but we're gonna get into that in a minute. But these are the Retro White Midnight Navy Jordan 4s. I got them in a grade school size because it's way cheaper than getting them in a regular woman's size. I got them in a size five in youth, which is equivalent to a six. And they fit me actually really perfect. So yeah. But guys, oh my goodness. Look, I already tried them on and they fit perfectly. There's room at the top, a little bit of room at the top. They're not too tight. I honestly think that they're perfect. Look at them. I was gonna get military black, but I wanted to get two pair of shoes and I was trying to be cost efficient with all my stuff. So I also got the Jordan 4s and Fred's in a five size youth um, from StockX. They just come here the first day of school, which is okay with that because I was gonna wear these on the first day of school anything or anyway. So I know I look a mess right now, but I have to edit this into the video. My second pair of Jordans ended up coming earlier, surprisingly, so I'm gonna show you guys them. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yes, what's up? Now that my shoes are done with, let's move on to this box. And I literally lost my glasses and I want to cry because I'm so blind. Like, it's like, the more I don't wear my glasses, the blinder I get. Which is like, duh, that's how it works. Oh my goodness, guys. So happy. I don't even know if I can pick this up because I'm like, guys, look at this receipt. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, it's not ending. It's not ending. It's ripping. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's down in there. I'm used to them coming like like this only this much why is it this long oh my gosh guys look at this receipt this looks like my mom's grocery lit for Christmas dinner oh my goodness oh this is heavy and my arm hurts ah! <laughs> also just for reference everything I either got in a small or an extra small I'm gonna put it on the screen of course dang I got a lot of like gold jewelry which is so funny because in eighth grade and like my friend Sophia, she can vouch for me. I used to be like goth emo, meaning like I would lean towards the more silver side of jewelry. But like now I literally love gold jewelry. It's like more cleaner. This is all the jewelry. I know it might not seem like a lot, but I got a pretty good amount of gold jewelry. And then these are, whoa, these are the clothes. Before we even get into any of that, I want to do the little miscellaneous things that I said I was gonna do. Okay, I have my baby sister and I found my glasses. Say hi, say hi. Good job, good job. So, if you guys haven't watched my first day of freshman year, get ready with me. If you haven't, go ahead and watch that because I think it was a nice video. I had platinum bomb blades and everybody was like, 
get those again, get those again. If you get this hairstyle, make sure it's platinum. Da -da -da. And let's just say platinum is definitely, definitely, definitely back. So I got the hair stuff for it. I'm not going to tell you guys the style, but I'm going to show you guys the two things. And if you know, you know. So this platinum blonde, kind of like wavy hair right here. Right, right, right. And then for the actual braiding hair, I got this platinum blonde mixed with kind of a honey brown-ish, I guess, hair. And this is color um, 27 and 613 mixed together. You can buy them separate and mix them yourself, but my mom doesn't know how to mix hair, so she bought them mixed together. And then this is color 613. And that's what I got for my hair. I got the McCart rhinestone glue, and I'm gonna show you guys what these are for. They aren't for rhinestones, but they're for the chrome kind of crosses that people put on their nails nowadays. And I got, um, I think this is a 60 piece pack from off of Amazon. And these are how the crosses look. Don't mind my nails. I do my own nails. Okay guys, so I'm back. I had to help find the car key, which is like this small. We were all looking in the house the whole time it was outside. So yeah, but let's start with the clothes. That was actually like really loud. So let's start with what's in the first bag. Okay, so in this bag were the Sheen Easy Wear three-piece solid backless halter tops. Um, it comes with the brown, a white one, and a black one. And I got them in a size extra small. These are how they fit. They're way longer than I thought they were gonna be, which actually isn't a bad thing because all my like halter tops that I already have, which I only have a black and a white one, but they're getting kind of small and other stuff. So I need to buy new ones, obviously. And this is the back. Obviously, I would either wear a strapless bra or I would put on a cover-up or something like that. But this is really nice. The material is different. It's very breathable. Time for the next bag. So the next item are the Sheen Easy Wear V-Waist Flare Leg Pants in a size extra small, so two. And I got them in gray. I'm going to stand up and show you guys. But these are interesting one i expected them to be lighter to a different material and then it's kind of wonky like up here if you know what i mean and then let me sit on my bed <laughs> but these are how they fit i mean they didn't like they weren't giving what i thought they were gonna give but honestly it's not that bad i just wish it was a little tighter around the thigh and like it wasn't like whatever's going on here next baggy this is white next thing is the sheen mod figure graphic crop tank top in white in a size extra small this fits way better than i thought it was going to be i thought i was going to have to size up but i'm actually glad i got an extra small because it would have been too big as a size up oh oh my goodness my body looks like really good in this oh my goodness this is how it looks oh bam bam Anyway, I really like this. I also got it in a red. I'm gonna try that on right now. This is the red one. Same thing as the black one. Looks really nice. I do not have red in my closet. I kid you not. Next baggy. Next thing is the Sheen Icon Heart Ring Detail Runch Side Tie Backless Halter Top. That's a lot. And this is the color beige in a size extra small. It's actually supposed to like, these parts are supposed to tie around your neck, but I was just looking at it and I was like, why does it kind of look like cute like this? But when you get closer, like you can see this. So I guess you would just have to tuck this and call it a day. But it's actually cute like this if you don't want to wear it with like the tie. But we're going to tie it so you guys can get the full thing of what's going on. Okay, so don't mind the bra. Just pretend that it's not there because I would obviously wear a strapless bra. But this is how it looks. It kind of goes down. It's not really see-through. Well, see-through right here, just a tad bit. Um, but it's not see through up here where the busts are and then this is the heart ring But this is how it is and it has like this like little Whatever this is. It's kind of cute. I like it, but this is how it fits I've been wanting to get this shirt for the longest But like I had no money and now that I make money. I can get the stuff that I want. Thank you guys This is the back Can't see the back, but yeah, like I said wouldn't wear um, a Strap bra I would wear a strapless bra and this is really nice I think I have the same thing like this in black, so I'm gonna try it on, but I think it's a different name. Okay, I got it in black, so I'm gonna try it on. Okay, so this is the same thing in black. I didn't tie it yet, but this one has a different name. It's actually shorter. This is the Sheen Icon Heart Ring Front Halter Top in black, size extra small. It's like the same thing going on. It's not as 
cotton material as the beige one though this is more like a satin material silk i get those things confused honestly but if you know what i mean just by like looking at it you can tell it's kind of a different material the way it shines same thing going on same thing with the heart the heart is actually a little bit bigger and this one is like a little bit firmer up here or firmer in general i actually like this so this is how it looks with it tied like i said i think i like the non-tied look better than the tied i don't know why but I think I'll just end up tucking the tie pieces like in the shirt where this part is so it like isn't noticeable. Then this is the back, same thing going on. Next one is this one. I'm actually really excited for this. I know what this is. I was gonna get it in multiple colors, but I was like, let me just try this one first because this is the one that stood out to me the most. I was gonna get it in orange, but like, I don't know. I just got it in a color that's kind of like match everything, if you know what I mean. This is the Romwe, Romwe, however you want to pronounce it. Punk contrast laced runched halter top. And this is how it looks. It's also a top that ties in the back. And it's backless. I should have added that in there. But um, I mean, I guess you can tell just by what's going on. It's laced right here. It's kind of giving, not gonna lie, pajamas or PJs or time to go to night night. But I feel like depending on how you style it, how you accessorize it, it could pull off really nicely. I know I'm gonna pull it off because I know how to play. Huh. Why is mine just coming up? But it honestly is really good. It looks really nice in person. I feel like it fits me perfectly. I also got this in a kayak. Kayak. I don't know how to pronounce that word. Like, bro. Khaki. And I got this in a size extra small. <laughs> Next shirt, which is actually ironic because it's a shirt right up under this one. I have to tie this shirt the way that it's supposed to be. Okay, so for starters, this is the wrong way, wrong way, however you want to pronounce it. Punk paisley pin drawstring asymmetrical hem tube top. Now, number one, it looks way darker than it does in the picture. Okay, actually, that's a lie. It looks dark in the picture to the point where it doesn't look see-through, but it actually like is kind of, well, not really, now that I look at it, I thought it was gonna be, but this is how it looks, and then you guys like, a 360, this is how it looks. I'm gonna have to like pull this up or something like that. And then this part is supposedly supposed to be like right here, but like, I don't know, I feel like it looks better right here and it's like not as revealing right there. So it kind of gives you this like slit side opening, but if like I twist it a little bit, it's like this. I really think this is really cute. And what's funny is like this fit was gonna be my first day of school fit, but since the leggings aren't the way that I wanted them to be, we're just gonna have to compromise again. This is multicolor. I don't know, I, I just say blue, blue size extra small time for the next bag okay so this shirt is the sheen cooling letter graphic contrast stitch knot neck crop tee wow first things first i literally love this part of the shirt but this is how the shirt is it's kind of like trumpet sleeve just not as much trumpet sleeve if only the leggings were tighter oh my goodness i should just return these and get my money back because it's like um the color navy blue in a size extra small and this is the like orange lining that it comes with it says treasure of youth 89 1989 energetic with like two stars right here really cute next baggy i think these are pants so finally get to get out of these gray ones okay so the pants i'm about to show you are the sheen sxy solid rib knit flare leg pants and a size extra small in color coffee brown so like i said if the gray leggings were this like type of tight they would have ate but this is how they look they stay on my bed really nice material when i put them on they're cooling they don't feel like they're gonna sweat me out and i really like them they go like all the way up to here past my midriff which i like i'm gonna put the shirt down really cute i like them a lot this is the material really flowy at the bottom i'm gonna have to pick those up when it's raining bro this piece of edges keeps coming up like i need to stay down please let's move on to the next bag which is these, and I'm gonna do them in the color order because I'm really excited for these shirts. Hopefully it turns out good. Hopefully, oh my goodness, I pray. Oh my goodness, this is nice. My mom actually thinks it's kind of tacky, but like, this is actually nice. This is the Sheen Icon Dopamine Dressing Body Heat Matte Print Round Neck Tee. And this is the color yellow, size extra small. I got this shirt in how many other colors? One, only one other color, yeah because I also got long sleeve version of these. But this is how the shirt looks. A lot of people think this is tacky. Um, well, not a lot of people, my mother. <laughs> but this is the back, it's just plain yellow. I'm gonna try on the next color. Whoa, 
the next color that I got. Okay, so this is the Sheen Icon Body Heat Matte Print Tee in Army Green, size extra small, too. This is just the Army Green, same thing as the other one. This is the bag. It actually looks good. I thought it was gonna look bad. <clears throat> I love cold water. Oh my goodness. So these are long sleeve shirts. This is very vibrant, oh my goodness. Same thing as the short sleeve shirt. This is the Sheen Icon 3D Body Print Crop Tee in color pink, size extra small. It's not really cropped because it goes down to like my waist, but I'm fine with that. This is exactly how the short sleeve one look. Like I said, just long sleeve version. Don't mind the tag to the pants, yeah. But these are really cute, really comfortable. The material is kind of like whatever the shiny material is. I don't even know how to explain it. So this is the shirt that started it all. I think I saw someone with it. I don't remember her TikTok, but she kind of started it too, if that makes sense. Like she brought this shirt to life or whatever. And this is the same thing as the other one, just the color white, same size, extra small. This is really, 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 really cute. This piece of, okay, we don't have edge control this, because this is going on. The next baggie, I don't know what this is. I think this is my regular cami top on. This is the Sheen Easy Wear Solid Rib Knit Cami Top in size extra small, color light gray. I just got this because I was gonna wear it with my um, gray leggings and kind of like a pink red flannel because I saw this girl wear it with a teal flannel and I was like, this is so like perfect outfit. If you know what, why is this? This piece is really gonna be the death of me, you guys. So this is the top, just a regular, plain cami top that I can wear up under stuff or that I can pop something over or just something quick. Next baggie, I know what this is. This is the Sheen Easy Wear Star Pattern Knot Front Tube Knit Top. Did I say it right? I think I did. I think you're supposed to tie it, I don't know, like again, or maybe it just ties by itself. I don't know, I think you're supposed to tie it tighter, but I'm just gonna like tie it tighter later, I guess. But this is how it looks, of course, like I said, wear a strapless bra. This is the start, just something really simple. I saw this and I was like, why not just buy it now for one of the simple days? Basically black and white. I don't know if they had another color. This is the color black size, extra small. I keep forgetting to say the color and the size and it's kind of bothering me. Um, Maybe if I had no bra, oh yeah, if I had no bra on, it would look better, but the bra's kind of throwing me off right now. Just pretend I have no bra on. And honestly, this is really cute. I don't know if it's see-through right there or if it's just the pattern. Oh no, it's kind of see-through. But honestly, I think this is really cute. Pop it on with some jeans and you're good to go. Next baggie, I'm really excited for this, but this is more for when it gets cold or I can wear it in school during the time because school is cold in general. So the next thing is the solid drop shoulder sweater in a size, one size actually. And the color is white, but I think it's more of a cream than a white. And this is how it looks. It's kind of like this cross thing going on. Like this is what you would need for like the camis up under. Right now I don't have anything up under, but you kind of can't tell. And it has like holes in it, so I could wear it in summer whenever it's cold in the building, but I think this is more like fall or whatever. But yeah, not gonna lie, it is just a tad bit itchy. Um, just like the material that it is, but I think it's really cute. Next baggy, bag bag baggy. This is the grunge punk graphic print ribbed tank top and a size extra small color white i believe they have this in red and black it is see through as you can see you can see the tag and it's way like looser i thought it was gonna be tighter and more flimsy but actually once you like kind of put it on it kind of looks good i don't know what else there is to say about this shirt i feel like it's very basic just popping some jeans and ready to go so let's go ahead and go into the next baggy why am i calling these baggies like I just noticed this, just say bag, but I like saying baggies. This shirt is the Sheen Icon Letter Graphic Raglan Sleeve Tee in size extra small, color green. I think this is called Raglan cause it's like, it's not down here, it's not long sleeve. It's kind of like on the diagonal part of the shoulder. And this is what it says. Um, I just know that, I thought that was the word. I gotta go check out. I'm pretty sure it says always shining. I'm pretty sure. This is how it looks. They also have these in the black, but I wanted to get a green just to add more color to my closet. And it's really cute with the little hot pink stuff going on and the little white design of the shirt. And it's really nice. Like, it's a really soft material. Like, it's super, super soft. It's not like the cotton material that you're used to, not the itchy type of cotton either. It's just like super soft. It doesn't feel like cotton, but it's super soft. I really like it. Next item, and I'm pretty sure I got this in black too. So let's try them both on. 
Oh, this is so cute. So what I have on now is the Sheen Quiet, Quiet, Quiet? I don't know. Contrast lace trim rutched side bow front tube top. Why are these names so long? In a size extra small color white. I actually did have just a regular white tube top, but I literally lost that and I don't know where it went. So I bought another one, not just because for the reason that I lost it, but just because this one is laced. I love anything laced and it's just different. It's a little longer than my other one. It looks like this. I can actually pull it up in the back. Cause like, like people forget to pull their two tops up in the back. So like, it's like this when it's supposed to be like that. And then this is the little bow. This is the lace. Literally, I love like lace stuff. Like they're just so cute. These glasses are kind of making me look a little ugly, not gonna lie, <laughs> so I'm gonna take it off. But I'm blind, like it hurts my eyes, guys. I think I have to keep these on. But let's move on to the next top, which actually isn't the same thing. It's a whole different thing, but we're gonna just try it on, whatever. So the next thing that I have on now is this the Sheen Basic Solid Crop Tube Top, size extra small, in the color black, because I just needed a basic black tube top. I already have a white tube top. And if I find my other white tube top, I have that tube top. So I just need a basic black tube top. Also, something about the white one that I just tried on, it's like very firm. It doesn't feel like it's gonna like fall down because I know some tube tops feel like they're gonna fall down and you're just gonna be exposed. Same thing with this one. I thought it was gonna be too big, but it's actually like fits really, really nicely. This is the material. I actually kind of tuck these like, you know these pieces right here that they think you're gonna use, but you like never do. I end up always cutting them off. I was kind of scared that this wasn't gonna fit me when I pulled out the bag. And even when I was shopping online, I tried to find something in the reviews. Cause lately I've been checking the reviews with Sheen cause sometimes I'd be doing them wrong and it's done me wrong before. And ever since then I've been checking reviews, checking reviews and I just went with the black tube top that like suited everyone the best. And this was the one and I'm glad I got it cause it's so, basic just a plain black tube top that can go with anything you cannot go wrong with just a plain shirt that can go with anything i think there's a pants but let's open it and see because i honestly don't know okay so this is the sheen Kool-Aid body heat matte print drop shoulder tee did i say that right yeah and this is the size small not extra small um i should have got this in a regular size instead of sizing up because it's way bigger than i expected it to be but if i like put it to the front then it's good but like it's still big i should have sized down to my regular size i didn't expect it to be this big i actually saw my friend cameron or cam with this shirt and i was like that's actually really cute let me get it and i found it on sheen i wasn't looking for it. i just found it and i was like that's actually really cute is i got it too big like this is actually gonna bother me but like, I feel like just wear it for a chill day, pop it off in jewelry. It's still gonna look good no matter what. Like, it's just bigger than I expected it to be. Let's move on to the next bag. We're getting closer to where the pants are or less clothes than we're gonna move on to the jewelry section. This is so cute, oh my goodness. So this right here is the Sheen Mod Twist Front Rib Nip Tube Top in shade beige, extra small. They have like this like kind of like rubber material and I think it's supposed to prevent the tube top from sliding down. So kudos to Sheen for that because I don't really see tube tops or anything that can like slide down, have that type of material. And it's not like annoying either. Like I can feel it right here because obviously I have a bronze so I can't feel like everything. But I feel it right here and like you can't feel it if that makes sense. And this is the back right here. Not see through. Yeah. And then this is how the twist looks. This is so cute. And it's like more beige in person. I know it seems a little bit lighter, but it is more beige in person. Really cute. They have a bunch of other colors. This is just the first one that I got. I know they have red, but I didn't want this to look like this, but they actually look like completely different. And I was actually scared about how this was gonna look on me, but now that I know it looks good, I'm definitely gonna get it in more colors. Next thing, I don't, what is this? Oh my goodness, I know what this is. I'm gonna keep my tube top on for this because this one is kind of like a cover up. I already had this in a brown color and I wanted to buy it in a white, but every time I would go to buy it, it would be out of stock. And then when I went to buy it, it was out of stock. And then I changed it to a size up and it was out of stock. And so I was just like, you know what, I give up. But then she notified me that it was back in stock and I bought it. Also, I needed a new white cover up. So what I'm putting on now is the Sheen Icon Bell Sleeve Tie Front Textured Sheer Top in the size extra small. 
and in white. They also have this in pink, mint green, brown, like I said, and black, but I didn't want to get in black because I don't know. I thought white would be pretty. And this is like kind of how it ties. You also have this tie option if you want to tie it down lower, but this is so pretty. Just like a plain cover up, just looks like this. I think this is actually smaller than my brown one. I don't know, it feels a little like smaller. And it just looks like this. Like I said, it's sheer. And then this is the texturing. It's really pretty, really simple. And it's not like white, white. So it's not gonna get like dingy fast. So this is the last bag. It's not like a top, but before we get to the jean jeans, which I don't even remember what I really ordered to be honest. So right now I have on the Sheen Easy Wear Drawstring Waist Flare Leg Sweatpants. Let's stand up. And they look like this. Like I said, they're more sweatpants than leggings, so I'm okay with like the feeling going on. Now if the gray leggings said that they were sweatpants, I would understand that, but they said that they were leggings and they really weren't leggings because they were not tight. Then, I, I'm just gonna turn those because I keep complaining. But when I stand up, this is how it looks. They're not too long, they're the perfect length, and they tie in the front so you can make them tighter if you wish. And I really love this pink. You know the lace tube top that I was wearing? I feel like that would look cute with this. And it comes with back pockets. Pew, pew. You rarely see sweatpants nowadays come with pockets, which is like really crazy because they used to always come with pockets. And this is a size extra small in the color pink. Next are my four jeans and then we get into the jewelry. First pair of jeans. I love them already. But before I tell you guys what they are and show you guys them, whenever I buy jeans and I want them to be long, or any pants in general, especially jeans from Sheen, if they're not boot cut, I make sure I look at the reviews and see like how far low they go. But these are the Sheen Easy Wear Light Wash Cutout Ripped Straight Jeans. Oh, straight leg jeans. And light wash color and then size extra small. So this is how they look. So far, I think I have to stand up so you guys can see the full potential. Get out of the way. But like I said, they go like over my feet and this is how they look. I would really love jeans like this when they're ripped. I used to only like boot cut jeans or stuff like that. And I, I hate skinny jeans to this day. I will never wear a pair of those ever again. I don't care. Yeah. I also got these shades in a medium wash. They actually fit. Like I hate that. Like. I hate that feeling of anxiety where you think something isn't gonna fit and then you put it on and it does fit. It's like a relief, but I hate having to feel that. So these are kind of like the other ones, but these are the Sheen Easy Wear Light Wash Cutout Ripped Straight Leg Jeans in shade medium wash and size extra small. They kind of look like these, I'm not even gonna lie, but I don't know, do they? I feel like they're less like, I don't know. They still cover my feet, like, I don't know. Or were these medium washed and these were light washed? I don't know, they're the exact same type of pants, just two different colors. You can tell the difference. These are definitely, I think these were light washed. Or these were light washed, I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but yeah. These are the type of pants, like I said, they go over my feet, which I love. They're the exact same type of pants as the other one, just medium wash. Let's go ahead, let's just do these pants right here right here so the pants that i'm like about to show you guys i had to search everywhere for a pair of pants that were gonna look like these that were gonna actually fold over because i bought great cargos but those were the ones that were high waters and they scammed me which is when i started checking the reviews these are the sheen easy wear flat pocket cargo pants in uh color gray size extra small we're just gonna pull those up i don't know why they're falling down I feel like it looks weird with the type of shirt that's on them. So they're definitely baggy like how I wanted them. I feel like they would be perfect for my first day of school outfit, but I'm just gonna have to put that on a different time. They're like, they go over my feet, which is what I love. Cause I hate stuff that doesn't go over my, like over my shoes or over my feet, even the slightest bit. Cause then it, like you can see my ankles. There's no need to see my ankles. And no matter how hard I moisturize my ankles, you will always see my ashy ankles. There's no need for that. So they're actually really nice. The only thing is that I would need a belt or a safety pin because they keep falling down. And then I feel like with the tube top, it makes it look like off because you wouldn't pair these type of cargo pants, especially how, how baggy they are with the tube top like this. You just wouldn't do that. So it's kind of throwing it off a little bit. But when you don't pay attention to that and you just pay attention to the pants and you can envision it with a different type of shirt, 
honestly i really like it our last piece of clothing right here these are the sheen easy wear patch detail flat pocket wide leg jeans in a color beige size extra small these are how they look but this is the design that's going on i know you've probably seen these again they also have white and black and this is the jeans i already have a pair of beige khaki khaki i don't know how to pronounce that word cargo pants but they're not like this they're more like straight than baggy and i don't know are these too baggy let's go in the mirror and check it out also like i keep saying the shirt's gonna throw them off because you wear in pair together so i talked with myself in the mirror and they're not bad if you only pay attention to the pants not the shirt they honestly look really good next is the jewelry so i'm gonna bring everything over there so i have to keep going back and forth so this is a tote bag i actually have this in a cream color but i got it in a black just because like why not this is the leather pouch corduroy tote bag casual shoulder bag retro style crossbody bag with double handle in black okay so i already have this in a tan color i'm gonna show you guys right now my tan has kind of been through it it's gotten wet it's tired out i think i need to clean it but this is how it looks it's mark jacobs dupe i don't know i don't know but i got it in black just because black matches everything and you can never go wrong with a black bag and this is how it looks when you put stuff in it it's gonna look cuter so i just got this black little tote bag now let's get into the jewelry i'm really excited for that because i love gold jewelry this is the first necklace i'm gonna put it on and say guys the name of course okay so actually the name is too long for me to remember so i'm just gonna put the screenshot along with the name and all the information on the screen like i did with all the other things so let's go ahead and put this on try it on please don't mind my nails or this bra so this is the necklace it's like this just regular gold like chain with just like this pink stone in the middle it's really cute it seemed bigger on the picture not gonna lie but honestly it is what it is it's really cute this is how it looks i love it like i said don't mind my nails but look this is the necklace <laughs> but i basically got this like cross little clip cross cross little clip nose piercing thingy i had like so many like clip-ons for your nose and I lost every single one of them. And so I was like, just get one so it's easy to maintain and don't lose this one. And I got a cross because, like, I love my Jesus Christ, Lord and Savior. And I was like, if I'm going to have a nose thingy, then it should be on it. And I got this. But, yeah, it's really cute, really nice. Little, yeah. I'm going to put it back in the bag because I will lose it. This is how it looks. It's kind of like the pink one, except the charm is a little bit bigger. And it's a different shape. And it's white really pretty this is a necklace really nice it's just a plain like white one i feel like necklaces like this could rock by themselves if you want to go for like a simple plain jewelry type look necklaces like this are always the one to go and it just like doesn't feel like too much especially because like bracelets and rings they also complete the entire thing if you so this was the necklace like i said I like the pink one i love how the chain is nice and like small it's not too bulky all those clothes i gotta hang up like oh my goodness this is the next necklace it's like the pink and the green one like they just get bigger as we go on and they kind of change sizes oh it's a bag inside a bag so this is the necklace it's really cute another necklace that i think you could just pop on by itself let it be like i said it it's literally like the green and the pink one with the stone in the middle really pretty this how it looks gold none of my jewelry is silver the necklace this necklace, I actually have the name of this necklace, but I don't even know if I want to say it because I couldn't say the names of the other one and that's gonna throw my little order of fashion that I have things going in like off the chains. This is the One Piece Women's Fashionable Our Lady Pattern Brown Pendant Necklace in yellow gold. And this is just a one size. My mom's gonna be mad. She's gonna be like, I have necklaces like that downstairs. Why are you buying from that and not me? Go check out my mom's website, bodycandybylexib.com. She has waist fees, bracelets, necklaces, sunglasses, handbags, a bunch of cute stuff, like a bunch of cute stuff. And her shipping and stuff is like really fast, like three to six days. This is the necklace. I feel like this is really cute. Plain simple. This is definitely a necklace that you do not wear with other necklaces. I feel like it would look tacky if you did that. It's like, looks like that. I don't know. And this is the close up of the necklace. It's making me feel like I got that motion. Dang, this cross necklace is way bigger than I thought it was gonna be because it looks so, so small in the picture. 
But this is the rhinestone decor cross charm necklace in yellow gold one size. Cause I had a cross necklace as you guys know, but like I was wearing it every day in the shower, did not want to take it off and it started to turn the this color and not gold anymore. So I was like, I have to throw that out and it just kept falling off the chain and whatever, whatever. So I was like, no. I mean, I'm not complaining, but like, I did not expect it to be this big. So let's try this on. Cause I was like, what's better than one cross? Two crosses. So this is the necklace. Oh my goodness, this is definitely a necklace that you have to wear by itself. Cause I literally love it. I love how they fall right here and they're not like formal or crossing over each other. They literally like fall like diagonally like this. So I have like stones in the middle. This is a type of cross. This is the geometric charm layered necklace in a one size yellow gold. I like layered necklaces because you don't have to layer them yourself. You can just put them on and go. And I normally go for layered necklaces when I don't have enough time to apply two necklaces. And I can't even call my boyfriend because he's in New York and he's with his family. So that's that. And he won't be here on the first day of school. So that's that. This is the necklace. It's kind of like this white stone in the middle and then it has like this pendant right here. This is actually for my boyfriend or I got it like for my boyfriend's initial. And this is the fashionable stainless steel letter charm necklace for women for daily decoration. And this is in yellow gold, the letter N. Now this is something that I would definitely wear every day regardless of anything. Okay. So this is the necklace. It's really cute. So I think I'm gonna do these cause it's just one pair of earrings. They're smaller than I thought they were gonna be, but that's okay. But these are the earrings. It also came in green, but I was like, I don't really want green. So this is the earring. It's really simple, really cute. Um, I feel like you could do a big earring and then this one on your second, and then I would put my stud right here. This video is long. I did not expect it to be this long. The next thing I got, I think I'm gonna show you guys these, cause why not? We're actually for my braids when I get them. So these, um they like circle up your braids like this they're metal so that's nice and they circle up your braids and you have the threader to of course thread them through and they have these like dangly butterflies coming from them and i just got those for when i get my braids because you guys know in my freshman um get ready with me video my braids were accessorized i love accessorized braids i cannot do straight ended braids if i have no accessories on my braids they need to have curls at the end if I don't have beads, then eh, like anything. Now with these, I'm so excited for it. And these are definitely going in the front of my head. They're like these, like, it only comes with two. Or wait, it comes with kind of three. So it's like these things that spiral up your braids and it's crystals. And they have them in so many different colors. It's so pretty. And these are gonna look so cute on the braids. Like, like, look how pretty, look, that will look so pretty in a braid, like, well, it's gonna look dumb right now, duh. But look at it. And like I said, you just use the bead threader to thread it through. And this is kind of a short -ter alternative. Okay, so speaking of rings, we're moving on to rings that I got from Sheen. Starting with the first one, it's my initial in a ring. And I think this one was my size, so I was like really happy. This is how it looks. It's basically a K inside the ring. Let's if it's perfect. So this is the ring. Oh my goodness, I love it. I feel like I also need some rings to go up here, but we'll see as we go on. And just as my initial, something like that or something. Really cute. Love it, cause I'm not self-absorbed, but I love rings like this. Okay, so this is the stylish computer style micro inlaid cubic zynochromia. I don't know how to pronounce that word. Open ring for couple jewelry. Why does it say open ring for couple? But this is how it looks really cute it's like a little person inside i don't know why they call it computer style micro and i don't know these names be kind of weird when it comes to sheen so next one is i think this is my four for four ring yeah so this is the one piece copper and cubic why does it keep giving me this word xyraconia luxury digital four for four cuff ring for a dating gift what <laughs> this is supposed to be a dating gift okay so we're gonna switch it so like it's fit me this is the four for four ring i saw someone with tiktok on this i don't know if it's this exact one i don't think it was this exact one but i was like a four for four ring i have a four for four necklace even though it's going through it but like come on now it looks cute it's cute i like it a lot and it's not flying off my finger so the next two are actually ring sets we're gonna do this one since it's smaller i don't know what this is 
So it came with four rings. I'm gonna put them on my fingers. These are the rings that it came with. I they're so cute, okay? So it comes with this one, kind of like crystals around the entire ring. Then this one, I don't know what design that is or what's on it, but I don't know, it's just like a bunch of stuff going on. And then this one, kind of like an amber or whatever. And then this one with like just tool, tool, two stones. So these are how it looks, that's that one. And then this one, I absolutely love this one. This one is so, it's giving batty or whatever. I love gold because it also makes it seem like your motion got some rich, I don't know. And it's like, I don't know, I love gold. I feel like silver is not my color. It's the last ring set, okay? And then we have two bracelets set, so yeah. This is the 12 piece rhinestone decor ring. So this is the first ring that it comes with. This is so pretty. It's reminding me of like a magic mirror almost. The next ring, it's like just some cross design, kind of looks like thorn or whatever. Um, the next ring, just a minimalistic ring, you know? Cause you don't want too much going on. I understand. I actually have this ring in silver. It's not in my closet. I threw it out, <laughs> but this is the ring. So yeah, it's like two leaves overlapping. And then we have this ring. It's kind of like a little crystal. Gotta go all the way down to my hand. Or you can flip it upwards. I like rings like that. But you can flip them in two different directions. So it's up to you. Okay, and then just a, another classic regular ring. This is like another plain one. I also had this one in silver. It's kind of like a chain effect ring, if you know what I mean. This is nice. This is remind me of royalty. Then we have three more rings. This one definitely reminds me of a magic mirror because of how big it is. Like, look at that. Look at the way it glistens. Look at that. But just something simple with diamonds. Kind of like a chain effect with diamonds. And then this one reminds me of Rapunzel's crown from Tingle. And Rapunzel in the movie Tingled is like literally my favorite movie ever. Like, look at it. Like, I mean, a little bit. You can't lie. Just the arch in it, you know? Okay, I'm back. Sorry if the angle changed a bit. I'm gonna put all my rings in here so I don't lose them, because if I lose them, I'm gonna cry. So, last two things are bracelets. So, I'm gonna say the name of the bracelet that I have in my hand right now. So, I actually have bracelets like these, but these are the three-piece resin bangle multicolor one size. The ones that I have already come in green, yellow, and a uh, light brown. I'm gonna show you guys. But these are ones that I've already ordered before. So, like, I just got more. Bangles are actually, like, really cute. But these are the set that, like, I've already ordered before. And this is the set that I just got. So, like, got, like, my bangles. You know. But these are the bangles. They're big, of course. So, it comes with this, like, opaque kind of amber color. This white, like, cream color. Kind of like a pearl. And then it's, like, it's kind of, like, pink. Like, I don't know how to explain it. And it comes like this, kind of like that. Our last item, I don't even think it's on here. And that's sad, because we can't even name our last item to end this video. But it's basically this like three piece connected bangle. But I like connected bangles. It's more easy to keep up with. And it, like, these remind me of my grandmother. Bro, she's moving. Like, I'm just getting sad. I'm gonna cry when she moves. Like, I don't feel it now, but when she moves, I'm gonna cry. So this is the bangle set, like. Can't get tangled up either. You just slide that right on your arm, like that. So this is the design. It's gold, of course. Like, look at that. Look at, hear the sound. Three of them have like this kind of like diamond design, if you would say. And then the other one have like this box design. So those are nice. And that brings us to the end of the Sheen haul. So that was definitely something. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you stay tuned for the upcoming back to school videos because I am so excited to be putting those out and to be recording them and editing them. Actually, once I end this video, I have to go ahead and film my back to school maintenance video. So, that's great. And we're so close to 30,000 subscribers and I honestly think that is such a blessing and I am so grateful and I thank God for the amount of growth that I've got within a year. It's it's been a year since I had my YouTube channel. So like also happy one year anniversary to us. Like, oh my goodness. Without you guys, I wouldn't be where I am today. I wouldn't be able to get this stuff 
you know what i mean because i purchased all of it myself so thank you guys so much for all the love and support and i'm so blessed and thankful and grateful to be where i am today and i wouldn't ask for any more what comes for me is what comes for me thank you guys so much and let's just continue to keep growing and make sure to check out my community tabs because i do talk to you guys on there and converse with you guys text me on instagram because i do respond and yeah thank you guys for watching this video i love you remember you are loved god bless Mwah. bye